Son, and of the Holy Spirit. The faithful in America already know this pope is different, and so do their bishops. I think his emphasis is definitely on understanding, compassion, forgiveness. It's also true, though, that he's not changed a single church teaching. So uh, the old saying that it's uh, easier to ask for forgiveness sometimes than it is for permission uh, certainly resonates, it seems to me, with him. For American Catholics who go to church regularly, and maybe for those who don't, they're expecting a lot of this pope. Those expectations are wide-ranging in a diverse U.S. church. Many hope Francis can help reverse the damage done by the priest sex abuse scandal. For young people, this has been a major um, blow to their confidence in the, the worthiness of the church as a community. And so most millennial Catholics um, are really looking askance at the church and looking for, I think, more integrity, more authenticity in terms of what we espouse and what we do. Father McCallum and fellow Jesuit Father George Coyne both say the Pope will inspire, invigorate, and recharge American Catholics within American society itself. Fundamental to the American Constitution is the separation of church and state. But many Catholics feel that, you know, we kind of possess this. Gay marriage is against our beliefs. So we're going to fight it and fight it and fight it. His mentality is very different from that. And I think that he will spread that mentality just by being who he is to the American Catholic. The Pope himself is, I think, in many ways,